Hello again, Doc on the Clock with more Meg Mammal 3. You do not know how- we do not want to know how many rounds of solitaire I just lost before winning one. Well, actually, you may want to know, but I'm not going to tell you. Anyway, let's get these uh, six catches open. Metal Man! This toy is infamous among collectors for how often it gets damaged by its own attached blades, ruining the resale value. Oh dear, poor Metal Man. Just so easily destroyed by his own weapon. My animal, I made this. What? Character by Chef Meta. What? 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 Even? I do not understand, I do not know. And it's a giant metal. It comes with a built-in drone camera. Oh yeah, it's the Mega Man 3 one. And, okay, we got another duplicate. And here's Multi-Man, from this very contest. I swear we only made a prototype of this doll, but now our warehouse is full of them. Please help. Oh, it's not actually, it's... From the Dreamwave comics. comics. So it's not actually an original. That surprises me. I did not realize that. Shanghai. A precious doll belonging to Alice Margatroyd. Rumor has it that a program based off of it protects cyberspace from viral threats. Probably just a rumor. Alright. But now, let's head to Tier 5. Time to start the gift shop. You don't understand the gravity of these gifts. We have 15 energy elements to find and uh, 36 uh, trickster tokens. So we'll be uh, shopping hardly after we're done. Hi there, Gravity Man, who doesn't have a, uh, prompt. <laughs> welcome, welcome all to the Gravity Gift Shop. You'll flip for these low prices. What's with the paint job? Ah, paint on mine job. I simply wanted to try something different, that's all. You're everywhere, huh? Indeed, in fact, I've been able to collect royalties for how many of these simulations have used my likeness in the past. It was enough to form the Tory Empire that you're seeing here. Taxes this year are going to be brutal. Are you the one who's selling all these plushies? Because, uh... I'm kind of just finding them all over the place. Okay, well, we actually have gravity flipping going on. Which is going to make navigating these, uh... uh areas kind of maybe a little bit of a problem, but, uh... Let's see if we can figure out where exactly... Okay, our boss is up here. Something of interest might be down here. I can't go in there yet. Okay, this is gonna be a little bit weird to uh, get around, but uh, I should be able to figure things out. <laughs> Let's go to 129th place. Get things started with Bakery Man by Darko Hexar and Linatendo. That should probably be Lintendo. <laughs> Overpronouncing things. Uh, Flashman up at top, Ace down at the bottom for this one. Oh, wow. Um, but there is a couple of zeros in the fun score here. There might be a reason for that, because, uh, yeah, the skip gauntlet isn't done. Two energy elements, four tokens, and a skip teleporter. And, okay, some effort put into the backgrounds here. 
That might indicate that more effort was put into the backgrounds than uh, into the stage design. <laughs> Careful! Please enjoy and perish. I, I would prefer not to do the second of those, please. This level's difficulty is overcooked, if you ask me. There's an overabundance of death spikes and mean setups. Maybe they should have used damage spikes as a substitute. Not that that would have helped my chip too, though. So. Can't find my keys, man. Has. I once dropped my keys into a vat of cake batter. Took me 45 minutes to find them all. Ruined the flavor of the keys. Finding all the elements and tokens in this level took just as long, and you can't get them all in one bite, so to speak. Don't force yourself to go back for seconds. It might be more appetizing to pick up what you missed from our pantry to the left. Okay. So that's a warning that I'm going to have to do this stage twice if I want to get everything. Minimally. Uh, so, uh, yeah. This might be one stage that, uh, we do in two episodes. It's, okay, he's just got a little gun. With a kind of nifty little, uh, shot there. Okay, so, the cakes drop. Is this what I mean by a cake's falling in the oven? Um... Well, the pies rise, so... Does that mean they're saying pie is superior to cake? Uh... I know that's been a long-running debate, and, uh... My take on the debate is... It, it depends on what type of cake and pie. Neither one is inherently superior, just some of them, uh, taste better than others. Okay, despite, uh, Metal's so short stature here, I cannot just, uh, walk through. I cannot just walk through one tile, uh, things. That's... Oh, oh, those are springs. I thought those were spikes. <laughs> That's why I jumped off early. Okay. Uh, those are spikes that I did not notice because they look very much like a background object. Oh, boy. Um... Sweet Alley and Bread and Butter. Okay, so... Here's where we have our token split. I'm gonna guess that up has the lower number tokens and down has the higher number tokens. So we'll start with that. What is the... I am having a hard time figuring out this, uh... Okay, it's not... Okay, it's probably just snow then. Because I thought this was a conveyor belt, and it's not conveying me at all. Okay. I see that arrow. Oh, shoot. That was not what I expected to see. No. Okay, uh, there's bolts up there, but, uh... Okay, but now, what was the point of coming down here? I 
feel like there has to be a point. Uh, so, but we're gonna look and see what's up here first. Provided I don't screen transition, I can go back to that at any point. Okay, that's a... That is, in fact, a token challenge. Okay. Ah, uh, okay. I am not... I do not like the positioning of that uh, gear you there. I don't like the position of that one either. Or that one. Yeah. Oh, I can't get that. All right. And we are at 20% uh, of the tokens, which means there is like... Jeez, 570. Oof, that's a large number. Uh, also, that's the second token, so I might have missed one in pre-split. I'm not too worried about uh, missing one pre-split, though. Uh, Eskaru better done with uh, uh, Laser Trident. Uh, wait, I can't... Ah, uh, I can't do anything about you. That's not good. I don't like that. Okay, I got the token, so that's... I am okay. Okay, you know what? Damage tanking to survive. And... Delicious pastries being fired as missiles! What a nightmare! Okay, yeah, they, uh, whoever made this stage... <laughs> Actually, you know what? I'm gonna guess that one person was focused on the aesthetics and one person was focused on the stage design, because this... I have to admit, this stage is extremely cute. <laughs> I have to give near top marks for aesthetics, because these backgrounds are adorable. Uh, if only the spikes stood out more, I would be probably getting going perfect on that. Oh, you are also Pharaoh Man, huh? Um... Um... Oh, you also... We're about to do something unusual. Okay, well... I was trying to find a weakness. I think it might end up being Ice Wall. We will give it a shot to find out. Yeah, it's Ice Wall. Okay. Well, we're gonna try and do this. Uh, I am locked in there! Thank <laughs> you. 
<laughs> Alright, well, I mean... It really was mostly Pharaoh Man, but, uh... It did have one extra thrill thrown in. Ah! We're not done yet, Mega Chump. Um, okay. Suddenly, extra level. Okay. Uh. He clears! Okay, they're cone heads, but still, I can't call them cone heads when they don't have cones! Excuse the heck out of me, I d was not holding the button there, and uh, it still bounced me extremely high. Okay. So this is. <coughs> this is very clearly a bonus path. Uh, well, that didn't work. <laughs> ah, okay, those are explosive. That's why I keep getting hurt there. Does anything work on me? Just no damage whatsoever. It does not matter. Okay, those don't actually need to be, uh, hit with, uh, Thunderbird. Oh! I thought I was gonna be far enough away. Oh, I had a feeling that was going to happen. Okay, interesting rush. Jet and Rush Bike are disabled. Rush Coil and Magma Beam are not, though. It's kind of more important that the weapons aren't disabled. Uh, okay, that, that, I'm safe, I'm safe. I am jumping poorly, though. Oh! Gotta try and get that. Oh, wait, that... Capsules don't, uh, despawn like regular power-ups. I, I don't... I did not need to rush there. I mean, they may despawn eventually, but they do not despawn as, uh... as rapidly, by far. Okay, it's fine. Need to be further over, but... 
Um, I have just... There we go. Oh, I was not paying attention. I didn't realize. I didn't notice the spikes. I was looking at the flower. Ah! Ah! Running into some uh, mild uh, weapon energy issues here. Uh, exacerbated by poor decision right here. I'll take that. Okay, let's pay attention this time. Uh, that's just not worth it. Well, there's the token. Uh, Yeesh. I don't trust this. Uh, what is going on here? Whoa, jeez. I do not want to get too close to this guy. Suits Alley, Red and Nard. Uh, I'm confused by how everything has been going here. Oh, jeez. Oh, ah. I was too slow on the draw there and did not jump in time. Ah. Okay, I'm actually being hurt by this. Ah. Is there any reason to go up there? I'm not actually 100% sure yet. Oh, those are spikes hidden by the suits. Oh, and those are spikes, too. I... Okay. I am starting to see why this uh, stage has been... Uh, chided for its difficulty. It's not, like, inherently supremely difficult, but there's a lot of spikes 
either hidden or in really inconvenient locations. And it is, uh, kind of wrecking me here and there. Get off of me! Okay, I am I am switching to the upper path. Like this time it's not my fault that I can't see the spikes, that I'm not seeing the spikes. They are deliberately being hidden. In ways that are not particularly fun. Gives me an E tank, but it's also like the considerably easier path. Which I don't understand why they're make, giving me the easy path. Okay, uh, there's too much going on now. Okay, that is not gonna work. Destroy the dropper. And now the, uh, the Claris have suits. Makes no sense at all, but it is what it is. Oh, and that one is indestructible. So, careful! Oh, what is this nonsense? Sorry, I am just bypassing that. I don't know what exactly to make of this, but it doesn't look fair to me. Here's Baker Man with a suit. Uh, and with the power of Top Man as well. Um, dodging both uh, Top Man's attack and Saturn's slide attack at the same time sounds not entirely reasonable. Like, I want to stay away from... Ugh. If you're in just the right spot, you have to be right near the edge of the uh, suit platform there. Oh, there's an energy element. Wow, that was kind of a long stage. Here we have Master Alberts, Model A, in other words, Model Adorable. Uh, the plush you might not do it justice, then. Okay, well, we've got to go back in for another uh, token and uh, element. So I guess we're going to do that. Uh, but we'll do that next episode. That's all for me for now. Until next time, this is Doc. I'll see you later.